turn me up. What's good guys? So today I want to talk about a character in the MCU that I think is absolutely wasted. This character had the potential to be one of the greatest MCU characters ever, but they fumbled it. Now the character that I'm referring to is Drax the Destroyer. Drax the Destroyer started off as a total badass in Guardians of the Galaxy 1. I mean he was completely serious, barely had any funny scenes, and then he was just turned into a complete joke. I made a poop shaped like a fish. And I 100% blame James Gunn for this, 100%. And you see the same thing with King Shark in the Suicide Squad movie. King Shark is essentially the Drax of the Suicide Squad. You know, all throughout the movie he's treated like a joke, you know, he acts like a freaking baby. And monster nom nom bird. But King Shark's not supposed to act like that. He's a monster shark with scars all over his body, like he's supposed to be a literal threat. But this is not about King Shark, it's about Drax. Drax was a warrior in Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 1. I mean, he was just everything threatening, menacing, like everything you wanted from Drax, he was that. With a perfect combination of being funny. You know, in Volume 2, he was less menacing. He was really lacking the menacing, threatening, you know, Drax, serious Drax. He was more funnier, you know what I mean, calmer and stuff. I'm not saying Drax has to be a murderous, you know, raging, threatening monster all the time. You know what I mean? I'm just saying James Gunn really took the Destroyer out of Drax. In Volume 3, it just gets so much worse. In Volume 3, they just up it to a thousand. Like, he just makes joke after joke after joke. Just not, like, no serious scene in the movie. Like, I swear. Him and Mantis just act like complete children. And the only serious scene he has in the movie is ruined by a joke right after. Life is a pond. And you've spent your entire life leaping from woman to woman as if they are lily pads upon this great pond. Perhaps what you need to do, Quill, is learn to swim. That actually made sense. Yes, it made sense. Yesterday, I made a poop shaped like a fish. They call him slow like literally three times in the movie. I'm angry too. Can't you see these authentic mechanic uniforms that we're wearing on our bodies that blend in with some of our skin tones better than others? Excuse my friend, he he's the boss's nephew. He's a little... Oh. Get your boots off her pillows. I find it hard to believe. It doesn't have multiple purposes. I'm sorry. My friend is a dumbass. Yeah. And not to forget, Nebula had to really like scream at him and call him out for his unseriousness. Yeah, I was able to knock down that door. Why'd you think you're I'm probably dead because of you. I didn't know. Oh, you didn't know? Why are you going to stop using the excuse of being some big dumb clown for contributing nothing and the rest of us having a curious laugh? I just really wish James Gunn would have changed them to the Destroyer in Volume 3, you know. I'm really disappointed with his character. And I forgot to mention, like, even in Volume 2, while he was being, you know, funny, he also had serious scenes. Like that one scene where Drax and Mantis are sitting on the steps and she touches his arm and feels the pain inside of him. She was like you. Disgusting. Innocent. Drax in the MCU is just so different from his comic counterpart, like in the comics he's fought Thanos, he's fought Stellaris, he's fought the Blood Brothers, like oh my god. And the worst part about all this is that his game counterpart puts him to complete shame. His game counterpart is smart, funny, and menacing. The perfect combination of all three, not one above the other. He may have not killed Thanos, but he still is Drax the Destroyer. Him and Star-Lord have this one sequence in the game where if you find him, you can interact with him, and I think it's one of the greatest sequences in the whole game. So, uh, this is the thing you had to do? Come to the observation deck to look at the rift? No. I came to honor the memory of my family. They died without meaning. Or honor. I think I know what you mean, man. My 
mom when the uh, Shatara came. She also died for no reason. They just... shot her. At least she's in a better place now. Even though I'm saying all this, Drax is at times actually very funny and very cool. Can I bet your puppy? Yes. <laughs> Mantis, look out! He's a planet. How could he make a baby with your mother? He would smush her. I, I just wish James pushed that aside and just brought the destroyer out in him. That's all. Don't get me wrong, James Gunn is a phenomenal director, but I don't think he can handle like monstrous characters like that. But with all that being said, um, let me know what you guys think about the video. Um, I'm going to be posting more consistently now. I know I've stopped for a while. You know what I mean? I apologize for that. But let me know what you guys think about the video. Um, like and subscribe, and I will see you guys later. Peace.